Hi everyone and welcome back to my channel. Today I am reviewing the Drunk Elephant TLC Framboose Glycolic Night Serum. That is what she looks like. Before we begin the video, I'd love to invite you to subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. Make sure you hit the notification bell so that you are notified whenever I make a brand new upload. And also be sure to add me on all of your other social media platforms. I will link my handles down below. So we are reviewing the TLC Frambo's Glycolic Night Serum. You can find this at Sephora, DrunkElephant.com, and Amazon via an authorized seller. Um, she retails for $90 and you do get one ounce for this specific bottle. And they also have a giant TLC Framboos. She retails for $134 and you do get 1.69 ounces. So that's a lot of TLC. That's a lot of glycolic. According to DrunkElephant.com, uh, their products have a three-year shelf life and after opening, the products are good to use uh, for up to one year. Baby Facial and C Firma, of course, are the exception with having, I think, shorter uh, life span after opening. So now let's chat about some ingredients. Um, you do get glycolic acid, which is the second ingredient within this product. Um, glycolic acid helps to break down bonds between cells and it also acts as a degreasing agent. TLC Framboos, however, contains an AHA blend of 12% uh, of glycolic, tartaric, lactic, and citric acid. You have lactic acid, which is also an AHA, and this one is derived from milk and sugars. This also breaks down the bonds between cells to allow for easier exfoliation of dead cellular debris. And this also hydrates the skin and also uh, prevents discoloration. Citric acids also an AHA derived from citrus fruits, increases hyaluronic acid levels in the dermis and epidermis to help the skin attract and hold moisture more effectively. We also have salicylic acid within this blend. Um, salicylic acid is a BHA or a beta-hydroxy beta acid and it is an oil-loving acid. Because of this, it is able to penetrate through oil-filled pores to unclog pores. You also get sodium hyaluronic, which due to its small molecular size, this deeply penetrates the skin. It hydrates, it reduces the appearance of fine lines and wrinkles, and it also promotes firmer skin. I have used this product, I think, maybe for two to three years. This is my second unit, and I am literally like down to my last pump. Um, this is something you can do with your Drunk Elephant product. Um, you can break them apart to kind of see how much product you have left and I literally have maybe like two to three applications left This is my second unit and I already have you know a third one just kind of waiting in the wings Tap me in tap me in I can do it. I can work for you. This one here is my second unit What did I use before? Uh, TLC Framboos. Um, before TLC Framboos, I used Murad's Glyco Complete Reform. I kind of used that to uh, help me condition the skin for TLC Framboos. And I did that actually by maybe accident. Um, don't get me wrong, I feel like Glyco Complete Reform was the perfect serum to introduce a glycolic acid-based serum into my skincare routine. And although it did give me results, I feel like my skin was ready for something much stronger. So while Glyco Complete Reform did contain glycolic acid. TLC Framboos contains uh, four, four different acids, so it's, it's definitely much stronger, more potent, and it gave me exactly what I wanted. 
um, as far as results. So I definitely agree that Glycocomplete Reform is gentle yet effective, whereas TLC Frambu's is personally much stronger, of course, and very effective. I feel like um, Glyco Complete Reform definitely conditioned and prepped my skin for TLC Frambu's. Um, and then I have normal skin and I haven't or I didn't experience any irritation from either one of those serums. As far as results, um, depending on my sensitivity, I do uh, feel a pinprickle upon application, maybe a tingle here and there, uh, but sometimes I will not feel much at all. Um, typically the next day my skin appears brighter, smoother, and definitely more luminous. I just recently began to use this product uh, once more after using Paula's Choice Retinol uh, Booster and Murad's Revite Elixir during uh, summer and fall and I found that my skin really, really missed this. This does play very, very well with other brands, um, unless you have the suspicious six, as Drunk Elephant likes to call it. Although Drunk Elephant recommends that you mix everything and then just kind of, you know, put it on the skin, I, um, I love to layer my skincare products, especially if they are from different brands. I can be very methodical. So sometimes um, when I wear just Drunk Elephant, I will just kind of cocktail everything on the palm of my hand and then just apply it. But if I am wearing different uh, brands, I will layer. And then TLC, of course, I definitely always layer it. I can use TLC under Protini, Marula, and my uh, Murad Nutrient Charged Water Gel. Um, typically, like I said, my skin wakes up brighter, smoother, and more luminous. I love the way my forehead area looks after using this product. I know my forehead area is uh, one of the areas of concern for me at least. I do have like an expression line and I do have uh, some texture there as well, but this makes my forehead area look really good. I would definitely recommend this product to anyone with normal, combo oily, and dry skin. This is definitely something you have to condition your skin for or something you have to use maybe just two or three times a week until your skin um, adjusts to nightly use. If you... Um, I don't know if it may, if maybe you lean sensitive or just to anyone really. Drunk Elephant recommends that you follow this with uh, marula oil to maximize your results. And I feel like that is actually when I get the best results. As far as pros, I do have a couple. This is a, a chemical exfoliator, of course. So if you have sensitivities to physical exfoliators, this is perfect for you as it is a chemical exfoliation. This is a results driven product. Um, I feel like you cannot use this and not see results the next day. My con as usual with these Drunk Elephant reviews is that you just can't see how much product is left until you, you know, wiggle it and then, you know, you hope that you don't break it. See? I'm struggling. Oh, okay. So you, you have to do all of that just to know how much is left. So that's my only con. This is definitely one of my top five Drunk Elephant products. I will be sure to film a video soon where I discuss my top five Drunk Elephant products just as I did with my uh, Murad video. Um, I will probably link that up here or up here for you if you'd like to have a look. But I will definitely plan on filming something like that for you in the new year. So make sure that you all stay tuned. This is, you know, like I said, I highly recommend this. I know that um, 
if you are maybe a little bit apprehensive, say for example about paying so much for a product like this, that you perhaps invest in a little. I know Drunk Elephant does a good job at you know making kits, they even have their littles kit. So that could be a great way for you to experience this very transformative product. My skin loves it, I love it, I recommend it. So that is all I have for you for this TLC Framboose Glycolic Night Serum review. Please, um, you know, make sure to list any questions that you have down below and I will try to answer them as soon as I can. And also be sure to subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. And I will see you all in my next video. Bye.